Good morning. Welcome to this week's vlog. It is Monday, the 19th of August, 6, 10 a.m. 79 degrees outside. How are you today? We're going to ignore my little friend on my chest. We're just going to ignore that. It happens sometimes. Um, so I'm just glad I'm not going on a cruise. So it can come now and go away before we have our weekend in, fa in Nashville with fashion. And then a couple of weeks after that, we have a cruise. So I don't even think it's a couple of weeks. Um, I am about to get on the treadmill. I'm finishing up my coffee. In fact, let me warm it up just a touch. And then I want to talk to you about some decor in my house and get your opinions on it. One second. Okay, so let me start by showing you where I want to put this and then I'm going to show you what I'm wanting to put. Okay, ready? So this wall is in my breakfast room, dining room. It's the only one I have. The place we eat. And you guys know I love my clock. Um, I picked that up at Target. On this side right here, I was thinking of adding a place to store my coffee mugs because they don't fit in my cabinet very well. And I really, I really need to get them out of my cabinet. I'd like to be able to see them. They're my Starbucks mugs and a couple of other ones. And I'd like to display them. Now, I can't decide, I'm sorry about that light, if I wanna put it on that side or this side. And I'm gonna show you what I'm talking about or both sides. So keep that in mind when I show you this, what I want, what I have in mind to go on this wall. Go to Amazon. Okay, so I searched hanging mug storage. So right now, this is my favorite one. Um, I wanted to get four of them, and you see they're on sale. Battery light is flashing. I'm going to finish drinking a little bit of this coffee, get some water, go get on the treadmill, go take a shower after I cool down. Take a shower, get dressed for this day. I've got so much editing to do. I have so much, so much work to do today. And um, not just for YouTube, but for work work and the household and things like that. So I'm gonna try and get all of that done today and I need to get to comments. So um, I'm trying to do comments two or three days during the week. Um, I try and pop in and answer you guys here and there, um, but I'm trying to get to comments two or three days a week um, because uh, it's easier for me to kind of do them in a block. So that's why. If you're noticing that comments aren't being answered as much as normal, it's because I'm trying to kind of block out time for them so that I have more time with my family. Um, that's really important to me to spend time with my family and I have been neglecting that and it's just, it's important to me and I know you guys understand that and you guys are so nice to me. Um, yesterday the vlog aired, that was just sort of me standing here talking to you for a week and you guys were very, very sweet to me, not only about that, but about the pup science and I appreciate that. And yes, I'm still using those supplements. I ordered the three pack and um, I, I'm anxious for it to come in so I can try it for, for sweet Millie because I want her to feel better. That's the only thing that matters. And you guys understood that. Thank you. All right, off to get this day started and I will see you in a little bit. Good morning. I was looking to see if there's a mess behind me. There probably is. It is 5.58, the 20th of August, 79 disgusting degrees outside. You open that door and a wall of humidity just goes whap right in the face. And you're like, can it please be October? And actually, can it please be November? Because even in October, it's hot here. <laughs> I'm over it. Rob and I are over it. We were talking about it this morning. We were just like, I'm over it. Come on, fall. <laughs> Normally, Rob doesn't mind the summertime too much, but this year, really i i think as we get older it just really affects us you know rob's 50 and i'm 47 and i think it's just hitting us i picked up a new vacuum cleaner i have wanted an electric vacuum electric non-corded cordless vacuum for forever i really want a roomba type robot vacuum i really want one of those I'm researching them. I'm looking everywhere for the right one. They're really expensive. I'm not getting one right now. It's gonna be a while, but that is my goal, is to get one of those. Really is my goal. Amazon had this little stick back on sale, some weird brand, I don't know what it is, on sale, and it got great reviews, and I was like, okay, we're gonna try this one. So, it's here. 
So we're gonna play with it in a little bit and we're gonna look at it and we're gonna see how well it does. Um, I wanted something like after dinner, after I've been cooking, I can come through and vacuum real quick around my kitchen table, in the living room, around the, the without having to pull out my big giant gov because that is a big giant gov and it's so loud. <laughs> You know, after Chandler scoops litter boxes, I wanna be able to vacuum it up real quick without having to pull the big giant gov out. So that's why I picked one up. And where am I gonna plug it in? I don't know, because I don't have nooks and crannies in my house. I don't have closets in my house. I don't have places to store pretty, hide things in something pretty. But I'm gonna. So um, I'm gonna figure it out. When I purchased my kitchen table, which is gigantic, um, I still had two kids at home. Um, uh, the girls would come over, my son and his wife, and um, actually they weren't married yet. Um, more kids came home more frequently, and at Thanksgiving, you know, we had more family that would come over. My mom has since passed. Um, my family doesn't live here, they live in another city and nowhere near me and so we don't really use this big giant kitchen table like we should i'm thinking of downsizing yeah the problem is my cats are rude and they ruin my furniture so i'm thinking i'm gonna look at garage sales garage sales garage sales garage sales and thrift stores and things like that to find us a smaller kitchen table and I'm gonna get myself, either I'm gonna put a full bank of cabinets along this back wall over here, I'll show you. Or, um, kind of like what Miss Erica has. Now, I have had this before in my houses. We actually did this in a house we remodeled um, in a different section of our neighborhood. We lived in, an, in another house and we remodeled that one. Um, we did that one ourselves. We did not hire that one out. Um, and the kitchen, again, wasn't big enough. And so, I did a bank of cabinets, uh, upper and lower cabinets, that I actually picked up from a builder, a um, construction home builder, and I was able to get those cabinets for around like $200 for all of them, and they didn't match my kitchen, I didn't care. <laughs> and I put them over and I put a countertop on them that I picked up from the hardware store, and it was fantastic. So I think I'm gonna do something like that over there when I get a smaller kitchen table. My kitchen table, I would like for it to seat six. It does not need to seat 12 like this one does. So um, one, two, three, four, five. This one seats six, but it's, I don't know. I'm gonna have to figure it out, which means I may have to change my light fixture to kind of work and better. This, my light fixture is meant for a long table. I'm gonna show you all of this. Okay, I'm gonna stop talking and then we're gonna talk about this in a little bit. I'll probably edit all of this out and we'll just talk about it when I'm showing you. Yeah, we had uh, cats doing cat things last night, so I had to clean up my couch this morning. They, um, one of them was sick on the couch. Of course, they can't be sick on the tile floor. Mm -mm. No, they have to jump up on the nearest piece of furniture and make me have to clean it. Isn't that right, Biddle Biddle? Yes, that is my job to make my human work for me. So I picked these little pillows up. I picked up two different sets, you'll see. This one has like a texture to it and the other ones don't. Um, I didn't know which ones I wanted. And I intended to use whichever one I didn't like in here on the couch in my filming room. But we use all of them out here, so. They don't all match, that's all right. This one's more of a taupey brown and that one's a brown, tan brown. Whatever. These are easy to get in, but the next ones are not going to be easy. It's like a workout to get them in there. And then after that, I have got to get set up for a get ready with me. Um, and then I have got to film my stitch fix. Okay, I just said these were easy, and now they're like, Addy, are you thirsty? Who's that Joe? Who's JoJo? There we go. 
see, oh, you probably can't see over there. Okay, these are not easy. I mean, you can see, you do this on purpose, so that way you're, I know, I'm dark. The lighting is terrible. Um, you do that so that they're nice and full. And, um, oh, this one's kind of having a problem. What happened? Oh, the inside fabric is, uh, I see. Uh, it's kind of fraying from the cut seams in here. We're gonna leave that. I don't want to pull that off, just in case. So you just kind of have to shove. I think I'm going to put these in here for now in our TV stand. We just don't need where did that one go? I had two of those. Oh, we're crooked. I'm sorry, we're crooked. Okay, so let's take a look at that vacuum cleaner. So those spots are what I had to clean up on the couch this morning. Where is, let me get a scissor. Can't forget to mail those out. So many things I need to package up and mail out. All right, so this is the Musu. Oh, sorry. This is the Musu 618A, XL618A. So, oh wow, super easy. Okay. There's a wall mount and a plug. Alrighty. Let me get everything unwrapped, I'll be right back with you. It's like the right height for me. All right, let's see. Wow, okay. I know there's two stages. Let me read, hold on. Just wanna read real quick, okay. Yep, okay, I'm just gonna use it very quickly because I wanna charge it fully before I actually use it. There's level one, level two. You guys, this is great. Now this can't be like my everyday vacuum. I definitely have to um, use my big vacuum for once or twice a week. Like, But this will definitely replace my having to pull it out and vacuum up cat litter. Oh, it's fantastic, yay! All right, so I'm gonna use it for a little bit. Oh, it gets everything. Oh, now I don't wanna stop, but I have to. Um, look, seriously, and I vacuumed last night. Okay, this is fantastic, I'm very pleased with this. I'm gonna clean the brush roll because it says to clean it every time um, because I have hair. That's just all there is to it, so I'm gonna do that. And I'm gonna plug it in to fully charge it. And then I'm gonna vacuum around my living room. I am so excited to have this. So I'm gonna turn this upside down here. Yeah, see, it gets dog and cat hair and this is a string. So, um, but that's every vacuum I have, but it did pick it up. Normally this type of vacuum doesn't get it off my rug. I end up having to start all over again with my big vacuum. Now, like I said, I vacuumed last night, but what I'm, yesterday, I vacuumed yesterday. What I'm looking to be able to do with this is, go throw this away, is 
In the evenings, you know, I vacuum during the day or something, but in the evening, I'd like to run this around my living room, my hallway, my front room, that kind of thing, and just gather up the hair and the dust and cat litter and things like that, or after I've been cooking or like around the litter boxes after we empty them or change them, scoop them, so I don't have to um, drag out my big vacuum sometimes three times a day. I mean, seriously. Sometimes it's three times a day because I am, you know, cleaning throughout the day or Chandler comes in, he does his chores after work or something, and then there's a mess and I've already vacuumed. Anyway, that's what this is for. It's so lightweight. I appreciate that. You guys, these shorts are so big for me. Oh, but I'm not gonna get rid of them. I just got them. So they're around the house shorts. So we're just gonna be sloppy around the house, okay? All right, and forgive the lighting. So I'm gonna clean up here real quick. I'm gonna find a place to mount this and hang this and charge this. And I think I only need to charge, I only need to hang the battery, right? Oh no, this hangs the whole vacuum. Oh yeah, it hangs it just like that. Yeah, I gotta find a place for this. My laundry room is really, really small, so it won't fit in there. The two doors, when they open, um, they touch each other. So I can't even hang it there, and I don't have a plug on that wall. So I'm not sure where I'm gonna put it, but I'm gonna find a place. I'm gonna find a place. All right, I'll be back in just a second. Look who came home. Hello, how are y'all? It's a thousand degrees outside, isn't it? It is quite warm. Yes. But I have leftover pizza, so it's all good. I knew he was gonna say that Joe would like some leftover pizza. Would you like some leftover pizza, Jojo? I would love leftover crust. I know, but you can't have any. I have that. <gasps> what was that noise? What was that? Hello, little dog. How what? That was a noise I don't like. I don't like that noise. It's thundering. Let's go potty real quick, puppers. Oh. Ooh. Why are you asking to go out then? Come on. No. No. You little sneaky man. Come on. Uh -uh, get back. Come on, Joe. Let's go potty. Come on, Mama. Come on, Millie. Here it comes, first little drips on the ground. Oh, it's a thunderstorm. Oh my goodness. I know I'm a weirdo that I love the rain. <laughs> Absolutely love it. I just finished filming my Stitch Fix. Um, that was a great box. It was a great box this month. Oh my goodness. So, um, and my Fat Fit Fun Style is on the way. I don't know if it'll be in, that one takes a long time to get here. So. I don't know if it'll be in before then. Um, so it's about to rain. <laughs> little dog, it's okay. Did the alien squirt you? Did it squirt you, little man? Did it get you? Um, the kids are here, so I'm gonna go in and chit chat with the kids for a little bit. And um, once it starts raining and cools down, I'm gonna come stand out here and bask in the rain with a cup of tea. Yay, I know you can't see me because the lighting's weird. I will see you in a minute. Did you do it? Grayson? Grayson, did you try and run out? No. No, nope, not you, huh? You didn't do it. There's no video proof. No proof. <laughs> Grayson, is that your box? I, this is the same strawberry box we've had forever, and that is another produce box, and we keep just throwing paper from different um, boxes in it, and they love it. They absolutely love it. They get in there and they scratch in there and they roll around. They just love it. And I'll fluff it up every now and then. Where are you going, Grayson? I smell pizza. I really would like some pizza. And a few minutes ago, the cats were mischievous and knocked my bowl. That's Rob's pizza over there. Knocked my bowl down on the ground and broke it. So I asked Taylor to please, if he could, I'm sorry, I asked Taylor if he could glue it back together for me. I think he can. It looks like it'll fit perfectly with some wood glue. I think it'll be just fine. I just love this bowl. I think it's so pretty. Okay, I'll see you in a minute. How are you today? It is Thursday, the 22nd of August, 11.05 a.m., 90 degrees outside. Um, I'm gonna show you a little bit of mama this morning. She's having a little bit of a hard time. Um, I'm a worried. I'm gonna admit that. I'm pretty worried about it. Um, so, um, I'm, I'm distracted, I'm sorry, I was thinking about Millie. Tonight, we are going to the Astros game. So, um, I, we're gonna bring you with us, of course. 
Probably not as much as I did last time. You know, we spent a lot of time vlogging the game. I'm not gonna do as much this time. You know, you've already seen it. You've been there. We just went there a couple of weeks ago, but it is always fun uh, to show the baseball stadium and listen to them sing, deep in the heart of Texas. I love that song. I'm a Texan. We've been singing that song, most of us, if you were born here since you were in preschool, that was, you were singing that song. Um, my kids know it, I know it. It's just, we've been, that's just what we do here in Texas. Good morning, mama. Good morning, beautiful. How you doing, baby? How's you doing? I know, I know. Let's put some claw down. You want to put your head down? Got leaves on the floor. There's leaves there, beautiful. Oh, it's mommy loves you so much. Yes, we love you so much. It's mommy's baby. Mama. Yes, it's all white. Okay, put your head down, baby. Put your head down. Well, we are headed into the stadium. It's nine gajillion degrees. Wouldn't you say, babe? Eight and a half gajillion. Eight and a half gajillion, okay. There's Minute Maid Park right there. It's very hot, but we're excited and so happy to go to the game. We love going to the game. That's crazy. All right, you're gonna pull out the tickets? We will see you inside. Hello, how well, are you? thank you. All righty. Look, no one's here yet. Nope. Oh my gosh. If, if I could just, uh oh, we're not centered. If I could just tell you how good the popcorn smells. Oh. This is a good spot. What is, is that the baseball players are right in there, right? Under yeah. that thing? The dugout. Dugout, that's the word I was looking for. Is the Astros or not in this one, are they? No, the Astros are in this one. This one, okay. Kind of go down there and see if you can. So again, the roof is closed. I've actually never been to a game where the roof is open. If I sound funny, I'm sorry. I had to edit out the music. There's Torchy's Tacos, yummy. Um. Papa John's, there's Bluebell. There's all sorts of food over in that area. Good morning. It is Friday, the 23rd of August. <laughs> I can't believe that. In exactly one month, we'll be, there we go. We will be on boarding at some point today, at some point, the uh, Carnival Valor. Wow. 78 degrees outside. Um, it was raining this morning when I got up. I wanted to talk to you about a couple of things. One, in the vlog, I picked this up. I love this. I love this. Now, I've only had it a week. I hit that button. I've only had it a week. So, so far the battery on it has been fine for me to run around my house. I've run it on my rugs. It's not a deep cleaner, but it's picking up the hair, the dust. It's picking up the surface hair, not the deep down, need the regular vacuum hair on my rugs. 
um, I'll pop it up on my couch and give a couple, you know, cause it comes, this comes off and you can use it. There's an attachment. You can use it just like this. Um, and I appreciate that. I've used it on my couch, just all around my house. Um, I'm liking this. I really am surprised. Now I need to find a place to properly mount it. That's one thing I want to do. Um, cause I'd like to have a spot where I can plug it in when I need to. I'm using it two or three times and then I'm plugging it in and setting a reminder on my phone to unplug it. So I'm using it after dinner time and things like that. Last night I used it after I got home from the game at almost midnight. So <laughs> I am sorry. I gave it, I, I hope I got it. No, I don't know. But I stuck my Osmo pocket out backwards out of the top of my car to try and get the shot of downtown at night. Oh, it's so pretty. It's so, so pretty. I hope I got it. I need to look at the footage on my camera. Anyway, so there's that. And I, I have to tell you, I really like this. I'm pleased with this. Hopefully it's still on sale. And these shoes. Now, I just got these. I love the heel on these. This is a good size heel. These are by Earth, Earthbound. Let me look on here on Amazon, not Amazon, Nordstrom. These are without a doubt some of the most comfortable shoes I have ever worn. They were $77, which is really expensive, but these are the kind of shoes you're going to wear for years. Um, they just are incredibly comfortable. I'm going to leave them linked for you. The thing is this heel, this is what gets me and it has a rubber sole. I just, they're so comfortable. Oh. So that's the thing I like, you know, I like a lower heel. So I wanted to show them to you because I believe they're still on sale. If yeah, they're yeah, the black ones are. So they're 42% off from 129.95 run, go get your shoes. <laughs> Okay, um, I do have a headache this morning. It's from not sleeping well, going to bed very, very late, getting up very, very early, and just not sleeping comfortably. Uh, my hair is a mess. I have got some editing, a lot of editing to do, some housework to do, and um, I need to film a video. <laughs> so, uh, over on the cooking vlog, we're gonna be, we've been playing with, um, what are they called? Chuffles, chaffles, chiffles, chuffles, whatever those are. And they're so good. And I'm about to make one. Hello, it's Sunday. <laughs> I know the last time you saw us, we were at the game. Maybe I talked to you after that. I think I'll talk to you after that. It is 2.42, the 25th of August, Sunday. It is 88 degrees outside and raining. My favorite kind of day. But it is time to close out the vlog. Um, Let's get to where you can actually, ah, there we go. Um, back up out of the rain. It's time to close out the vlog. It is, uh, the vlog has gotten long enough, so I wanted to go ahead and close it out. That way we have a minute to say goodbye. I don't know why I look so orange and yellow. I don't know what the deal is with that. I don't know. My eyes are a little red today from um, exfoliating and too much retin-A. I'm working on some new skincare. All that's coming, the ordinary, I haven't forgotten, I'm just working on it. Um, it takes a while to do skincare video, you know, you gotta try things out and things like that. There's a bird that is not happy that it's raining, or maybe it is happy and it's singing for jo with joy. Anyway, all right, so thank you so much for watching this week. Um, I sure enjoyed spending time with you. Um, you know, we did all sorts of things this week between cleaning the house and, and a little bit and uh, going to the Astro game. So there you go and changing things up slowly here on the channel. Slowly, surely, but sh slowly, but surely, that's it. And um, kind of practicing with some new editing. I'm gonna be getting some new editing software and um, I don't know, got some things in mind. Gearing up for Vlogmas. Yeah, September is going to be incredibly busy for me. Um, we're traveling a lot in September between our trip to Nashville and then a cruise it, from New Orleans. And then right after that, we have a cruise and then we're home. And I'm excited about that. So I'm excited about the travel, but I'm also excited about being home and getting this house in order, getting things in order, because that is the name of the game. 
So I'm slowly getting through things right now, very, very slowly. I just, I don't have enough time to do everything I want to do between work and editing and things like that. So just know it's coming. We're gonna be doing some organizing. I really wanna get my closet cleaned out. I'm hoping I can get that done next week. I'm hoping, hoping. If not, I don't know when I'm gonna get it done because the following week we go to Nashville. And I really need to clean out my closet because none of my clothes fit. I've been saying that for a while now. Everything is too big. And I just need to get it out of there so I know what I have and know what I need, which is very little. Anyway, okay, so enough chit chat, enough about that. It's time to close out the vlog. It's time to say goodbye to you and thank you very, very much for watching. If you're new, I'd like to welcome you. I'm so glad that you're here and um, I hope you'll subscribe and stick around and uh, click the notification bell so you know when I upload new content. <laughs> so, and there is new content coming. More Get Ready With Me. Um, I have one coming up, which I'm going to try and film this week from, it's not this, this is something completely different, um, from Catrice. I can't say enough about that line of makeup, and it's inexpensive. That's coming up. I really want to share about that. I have three more items coming in, and hopefully they'll come in super quick this week, and I can film it meaning next week, which I don't know when that is for you, but I'm trying to get that up, but I wanted to be able to do a full face of Catrice, so I kinda have to break it up into pieces. I can't buy it all at once. So, that's coming. Um, the final three pieces are coming. And then, um, yeah, and of course I just said the skincare. Okay, I've been chatting for four minutes. You guys, I can talk your ears off. I really can. So, all right. Thank you so much for watching. You know I love you and we will see you next time. Bye. Is it raining? Do you have to go potty and it's raining? What, little dog? <laughs> what?